Hello and happy Tuesday, everybody. Uh, I just wanted to show you all something that I discovered about the new Nether update, um, which I think is really cool. Basically, um, because these grow side by side, uh, in contrast to regular saplings, like tree saplings, um, you can actually build walls and structures with the warped and crimson fungus trees uh, really, really easily. So you can see, like, I can make a house basically in about, like, half a minute. So it's really cool. I mean, you need to place the Nylium, so it's a little difficult in uh, survival mode. But, you know, it's it's kind of a trophy house. And, yeah, you can show it off. And some of the trees grow really, really tall. So if you want to make extra layers to the house, it's pretty simple. You just add, um, you just add more Nylium and more mushrooms, and then you can make these walls. I also got really into this concept and started building with it and I can show you what I've done with that. So here it is, a whole four-story house made by just growing a bunch of warped and crimson fungus. Uh, here I have a little garden of uh, regular plants and you can just see what it looks like on the inside. Got a little, little chill out space with a uh, some potions and some recreational edibles and uh yeah just a little music box and some cool things that's my bedroom um you're not allowed in there because it's mine and then yeah um just up to the top is just my little my little enchantment room so yeah i mean this actually didn't take that long to build without having to individually place all of the blocks so it's pretty cool seeing um a way to actually kind of build with trees in Minecraft. Um, there really hasn't been a way to do that earlier. I've tried with saplings, but it, it really just is such a pain because they're so picky about their generation. So there it is. Um, the only other thing I wanted to talk about today is I'm actually doing a giveaway. Um, this is just for Berlin because all of these sculptures still are in Berlin. Um, but I've got a couple of pieces. I've got the Dragon Springs piece, if you'll remember. Um, it's some kind of eldritch dragon that's breathing bioluminous and green tentacles above a hot spring with some speakers in it and, uh, and a person chilling. There's also a piece of a cathedral that I made. Um, you can see a little snail chilling uh, at the base. The idea for this sculpture was that it would be a cathedral that had been grown out of trees and then abandoned and much later you can just see what sort of survived so you can see the cathedral window is kind of still sitting on the ground uh, but the soil is built up all around it and something's happened to the trees on other sides there's also the the lantern piece it's got a glow-in-the-dark lantern as part of it um, there's also the radio from one of my other videos i'll list links to all of the ones that have corresponding uh, process videos in the description and finally, the phone with its bioluminescent charging stand. So yeah, there are these five sculptures. If you're in Berlin and or like very nearby, um, just leave a comment and we'll figure out a, play, a way to get it to you. Um, most likely not shipping it. You might have to actually come pick it up. These still are hanging out there and it would be nice to have them go to a good home. All the best, everybody. Remember, it's always Tuesday no matter what, and that on its own is cause for celebration.